Hello there, young man. You Purdue? Grant Purdue. You like the place? I'm thinking. Yeah, so how are you mixed up with Marcano's organization? Friend, I own and run department stores. But with this economy, well, I've got a lot of extra inventory, clothes, electronics, you name it. An old friend, Artie Higgins, says to me, Grant, it's all insured. Let me take it off your hands. You mean you let him rob you? My trucks, yeah. It was just supposed to be a one-time deal, but heck, Artie just won't stop. I can't take the fall here. Where's Artie take the trucks? He never told me, but last time we talked, I got the impression he was going to offload them to someone else. Uh, uh, what do you call it? A uh, 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 fans? Grant, if I find your stuff, it's likely going up in flames. Well, whatever you have to do to stop Artie. My gosh darn insurance has dropped me. Says I'm high risk. Can you believe that? <sighs> you bring me that truck, there's money in it for you. Artie's got some of his men working around South Downs. Thieves, all of them. I'll see what I can dig up. In the meantime, you stay out of sight. I think you should see what Artie's guys know about my trucks. Jesus Christ! that 
cocksucker. You're now dead shit! Uh.
So much blood. Look at all the blood. Should should have kept your head. called me a bit ago. Spent 20 minutes chewing my behind all the pieces. Told me he wanted to meet me at, um, at Mama Regetti's bakery, wherever that is. Don't worry. Won't take me long to find it. Well, I'm glad you're going after him. No one raises his voice at Grand Purdue, but, uh, the nerve. Word of the wise? Don't get in bed with mobsters. You'll live longer. This war I heard nothing to see here. Take off. The hell? Got him! Doing what we're doing. If somebody's coming at us, it's only a matter of time for they show up here. And what? We take oh, him out. Get there, stupid son of a bitch. Shit's turned bad! Send everyone! That's my error! Don't you know you're dead? Oh, you can't stand the party! <laughs> you know what, son? You're whooping like a I need some cover and fire in South Downs. No, oh, sir. On our way. I got this. Killing me. Kids joining the party. <laughs> Ah! 
Son of a bitch! He's all yours. Get that stupid Take son of a bitch! Shot. As asshole myself. Here, over here. Got nowhere to go. Fuck me. I knew it. I knew it. I can't fucking believe it. Maybe this will help. Can you send some guys to South Downs help keep it in our hands? I'll send my guys over, but I don't want to get in the middle of it if there's friction with you and Cassandra. I'm of two minds when it comes to Lincoln's legacy. On the one hand, he was a, a brutal criminal who killed God knows how many people. A new breed of mobster, a prototype for criminals to come. See, someone like that doesn't deserve the position history has afforded him. He should be forgotten, erased. But I also understand that Lincoln had a significant impact on the Italian mob in this city. He did what the Bureau wouldn't or couldn't do. He finished them. 